there's two main problems with learning a guitar. The first one is trying to put your fingers in the right places at the right moment. Mm -hmm. So it's like finger gymnastics, right? That's the first problem is, is trying to learn all, exactly where your fingers go. You know, it might be simple. You see a little tablature and say, okay, to do a G chord, oh, just put your finger here, here, and here. And then you try to do it. And it's like, oh, that sounds horrible when you strum it because you're, you're, you're off by a millimeter or so. And that's enough to make a horrible sound. Um, so that's the first big bar to actually learn the finger gymnastics and the right pressure and the exact position um, to make a proper sounding chord. That, that, that takes a long time to do. And the second big problem is the pain. Because when you're holding down vibrating metal or even nylon strings, um, they hurt. They hurt a lot. And your fingers uh, will get to that point where they're, they're cut and, um, and quite sore and painful. So those are the two big hurdles that all, you know, starting guitarists um, come across, right? It's very difficult. So with the Rock Dreamer guitar bar, these are padded buttons. So you can, you can press down on it and it doesn't hurt your fingers. So that's, that's one big obstacle. And the second one is um, these are all labeled. So on this device, to make a chord, you've got to push down one or two buttons, depending on the chord. So for example, to make a G chord, I only have to push one button. This button here, that, that'll hold down the right strings at the right fret position on the guitar to make a G chord. Now, if I wanted to make a D chord, then I would hold these two buttons down. So I would push these down and that would push down the right strings to make a D chord. <laughs> 